when you could meet as Pac-12 coaches and off-season meetings, whatever, do you guys talk about the RPI and how to schedule for that and crack the code? It seems like there's at least one conference I can name where they figured it out no matter what a team does. It makes the NCAA tournament. Um, is that something you guys <laughs> you guys talk about or, 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 so or strategize for? To answer your question, um, the pack, first and foremost, I'm really proud – to be a part of um, our Pac-12 coach, uh, just, you know, we have camaraderie within our Pac-12 coaches, all females, six of the nine um, have played at their university. Um, but yes, we have a strong culture, we can get together, and I'm very proud that we, we can pick up the, the phone or get on a Zoom at any time and be able to communicate, and I think that is unique. Um, also, yes, we've had strong conversations about what it takes for us to be able to have as many teams represent at the World Series, and this year, in 2022, it was the first. Uh, it was the first time that all nine teams were over 500. Um, you know, and th and that that to me is a big testament to our planning in the preseason. Your ability to be able to have a solid preseason, knowing we're all going to beat each other up and pack, but gives us the opportunity to be, to be selected for postseason. Um, so, to your question, yes, we do have conversations, yes, we were trying to get as many teams, and I still believe there could have been more, but the best thing about it is the representation here at the World Series, or even just at regionals, supers, and here at the World Series is showing that the Pac-12 is doing what it needs to do, and we need to show it on the field. And I think, um, I'm really proud, I'm really proud of what the Pac-12 is doing and representing right now in 2022.